Hey guys. So this is going to be our horoscope message for the week of the 14th to the 20th. And I'm doing it a little bit different this time. I am going to use my um, Lightseer's tarot deck to pull a message for all of us. And then I'm going to use my human design um, oracle deck by Denise Matthew to pull a card to signify a gate for each of the aura types. All right, so each video is going to have this beginning part, and then we're going to go into what's specific for your type after that. So we've got Sunday, that's today, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. All right. So this looks like a transformation week, like something big is going to happen. Um, it also to me looks like it's, it's like it's a, a dynamic change, but um, it's something that you are not, it's in an area that you're not paying attention to until this happens. You are otherwise distracted. And I feel like maybe this message is a good, um, I don't want to say warning, but a good heads up. For you to kind of um, be aware that something unexpected might happen around the middle of the week and it is going to um, trigger some old memories or emotions or patterns that um, you're ready to let go of. All right. So now we're going to get into your um, aura specific message. All right, so let's pull a card for manifesting generators. This is a splenic gate. So it has to do with your intuitive energy. It has to do with the type of energy that um, is instinctual, that kicks in when it is a matter of your survival. Um, it is usually um, triggered when it has to do with something that something big, you know, it's like a fear of responsibility or a fear of, um, a fear of someone imposing on your responsibilities. So, um, I think it's going to be, again, it's probably going to have to do with the, the energy that happens around the middle of the week that shifts and it's likely going to be a situation that triggers a, a fear response in you. You're going to be um, caught off guard with something that likely um, makes you feel defensive, basically. And so if you are aware that that could happen, that it could be something pertaining to that, when this does take place, then you're gonna be in a much better position to actually handle it according to your inner authority. Now, if your inner authority is splenic, then it might be a little bit more tricky for you because this is going to be triggered in your spleen center. Um, but 
um, that's part of the experiment. That's part of living your design is um, noticing first and foremost how these energies are affecting you personally and that way you can learn from it every time that something like this happens every time something is triggered every time something new comes in it's an opportunity for you to handle it better and um, it's important to know that all of the fears that are connected to the splen the splenic center are also connected to abilities and gifts. And when you conquer each of these fears, you are able to more easily activate those specific gifts and um, abilities. And um, literally every time it happens, every opportunity um, helps you to strengthen that, helps you to recognize that, helps you to activate and switch into that place sooner which will then you know strengthen it just like a muscle <laughs> all right so i don't feel like this week is anything to be afraid of i don't feel like it's anything that's going to undo any of the progress that you've you've made or anything you know scary or serious like that i just feel like it's going to be something that um you feel a responsibility to um take care of or to um control and those types of energies are very strong you know it's something that it will um overpower any of the other types like the mental energy or the emotional you know it will come in and take precedent so um i don't think it'll be hard for you guys to spot if this happens in your life um, I understand if you don't want to put your business in the comments, but you can still just, you know, send me a thank you or a heart or something and let me know if this was helpful for you. I'm going to keep doing these. All right. I will see you next week.